Hey guys, I am experimenting with how I'm going to share my yoga classes starting Monday, Monday, Wednesday, 12 to 1. So I'm going to experiment with my phone and my laptop here in my calm, cozy bedroom with my sleeping cat, Sassy, on the bed. <laughs> so today we're going to do um, just a short five minute sequence for calf stretching. So if you have a yoga mat with traction, that's going to give you a little bit more, but you don't need to use a yoga mat. So this would be on hands and knees and stretching one leg back with the toes curled under. And you're just opening the Achilles tendon, pressing the outer heel back. If you want to go into more of a runner's stretch, you can push through the arms, lift the hip up and back. Other leg can just dangle. So if I show you this way, the other leg's just dangling while I bring that outer left hip back. So that's a nice one to start with. You can also sit on a blanket and then bring that foot up, opening the calf this way, just pulling the ball of the foot up, and bringing that foot off the floor, and then you can straighten to your sweet spot. So you still get more of the calf into the hamstring at whatever angle and level you want. Cool. And then, of course, always do both sides. Good. And I to be even, I have to do my right calf this way. Heel pressing back. And pushing through the arms. Outer right hip back. Opening that whole right leg. Awesome. And then last thing you can try, if you have a rolled yoga mat, to smush out those attachments around above and below the back of the knee, you take a rolled yoga mat. You can have a blanket under you, for under the shins, and that softens it for the ankles as they lay there. So toes under the edge, and do it sideways. And then you put that rolled mat behind your knees as you come down. You could even stay squatting here, smushing out the backs of the calves, and then coming down. Woo! And it really massages and compresses the calf muscles and the hamstring muscles. You can rock side to side. like so, to get different aspects smushed out. And then the final one, um, after you do that for a while, either sitting on heels, here comes Sassy, or in the squatting position, if your ankles need to flex for a while. And then you can come to sitting and put that roll, and this could be a rolled blanket, foam roll, or anything under the knees. And then you can press back of the knee down into that roll. You're using the quads, the front thighs. And it's a nice combo to do this one after the rolled mat behind the knees while sitting on your heels. And then alternate. You could even press both at the same time. Maybe you grow tall. Maybe reach forward opening the whole entire aspect, backs of the legs, calves, and hamstrings. Excellent. Um, I'll check out this view later. How fun to see you guys all watching. <laughs> and then I'm going to try my laptop and see if that's any better. And now it'd be Monday and Wednesday, 12 to 1, free yoga um, donation if you want to my PayPal or Venmo. And um, as all of us, we're hoping to get through this more quickly 
then slowly, hopefully I can get back to doing massage and yoga at High Desert Yoga by mid to late April would be awesome. We'll see. Love you all.